Hey guys, welcome back to Legion TD2. We have some... Is that Master or is that the Grandmaster even? Players in here. Um, okay. <laughs> the two high elo with two diamond noobs. Uh, they don't really know that I'm playing cash out yet, so... Lock welcome in Breezes of the Abyss. Okay, I think that's Grandmaster actually, so 2.4k minimum. Interesting matchup, but I guess they don't find they don't find any other match at this time. So understandable. We should have we could have Valstrom again, but not the role for it. Sky Queen start, yeah. Possible. Mm. We have some tanks with it, so we have a we have a bunch of tanks for it. At the same time, yeah, Lioness works good with Canopy, but... <laughs> what else could be good with this? I have three different tank types. I have two different tech types. I guess I'll pick the Vulture on top. What team are playing? Oh yeah, Priest of the Abyss. <laughs> of course he starts with that as well. <laughs> Okay, um, let's see how we do here. Let's not try any any experiments or anything. They are high elo guys sending to me. Mm, let's try to read him. Let's try that. We are sending into a double tempest, all right. That is a bounty hunter. I think by doing this, he basically says, yo, we have to send there. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, 20 on 1, that's nice. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure about level 3 here, because we kind of need 5 more gold. We, ki we, we kind of need uh, Devilfish. Ah, uh, maybe we get a snail, who knows? <laughs> we don't, okay. Do we want to go Vorik? <sighs> Usually I would have, I would have done 20 more here. Ah. Uh... Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to hold with a Vorik, or, or with a lot of Poliwox. I think I'm not going to build the work too far in front, though. This is obviously very risky, but it will then allow us to... ...descent. Oh, no, he's treasure hunt on two. Ah. Uh... The snail. Okay. Maybe he needed the gold as well. <laughs> Treasure hunt again, oh. By a dragon turtle. Well, I was thinking... Did I? Really? Dragon turtle? Sure, let's go double dragon turtle. He's basically telling me what to send. So, the thing... I, I know why he doesn't want me to send Brute, because the Tempests have an ability that randomly attacks a ground unit. If there's only one ground unit, they will all attack that Brute, so... Yeah. I understand it. I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna do with that. With that uh, war, if it's gonna be an Alpha Male or a... Or the... What is he trying to do here? Yes. I'm just gonna push one more because that is not full send yet. Although he is kinda high value. Uh, not that high though, it's, I think 400 with the treasure hunt. Okay, nice. That that was that was a good send. Although this build is well, <laughs> let's say it's a whack. Because <laughs> 
Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I wish I would send against those kind of builds more often. Because that is really whack. I kind of want to resend against that even. Ah, but I, six is better. Because those tempests fall like flies. I. I think here is good to add the Eternal Wanderer. So he is kind of like I think there's only four workers at this point at level four, but with the treasure hunt that he had on like three rounds, that pretty much makes him stronger than that. So yeah, now sixty though, and he gets the violet. That is. So he's basically playing low worker, but treasure hunt every round. All right. What's new here? Seraphin is new. All right. We can definitely push some. Actually, if we send seven, we can get double Valshroom. That is all right because I have some units tanking for it. Yeah, I kind of, kind of wish I did the Delver in front, but I didn't want to make the lioness weaker because it could only get five buffs. But that's stupid. Now thinking about it, because it takes a while before you actually get that potential, and then it doesn't really matter that much. So yeah, I kind of had to push a bit now. I think the recommend values. I'm not sure if they take into account stuff like treasure hunt. But yeah, let's see. Go over the. Did you say brute? Not a mole? Let's go with brute. Let's let's get coached. <laughs> Thank you, coach. <laughs> if I had five gold more, I could get a sand butter. That would definitely be a better tank. Um, but yeah, I, I think it could be worse. He knows I'm not getting a lioness or anything here, so he knows that worst case I get devil fishes or eternal wanderer or another Sakai queen. So. Uh, so we add a dragon turtle. He did boost the mudman on last round, so that's that's very good. So he has a weak tank now. 80. These are, these sands are so low. Huh. You want to send 10? Yeah, okay. Fine with me. The leak again, nice. That's also a leak. And we are holding, and he's holding. Doesn't look too bad. So we gotta capitalize and yeah, keep pushing. Not too hard though. Oh, did he? Now he did not get the. Okay, so the one round he used the pack rat. But still leaked, so. Maybe my teammate is showing why he's two places higher than the other guy. <laughs> Big difference. So, not sure about alpha males. Because right now, this would be the only spot where I could build it without these ones hurting it pretty much. I'm not sure if I will get an alpha male at all. Don't want to have too many unupgraded units though, but. Maybe we'll go without an alpha male and just have a lioness surrounded by tanks. I think that's alright. Another 80. Well, I feel honestly pretty strong 9 with the Eternal Wanderer. So, I will commit here. I also feel very strong 9, which again makes us probably even stronger 9 because if they, if they then go 9, they know they can't resend. Mid leaked, okay. Well, I'm holding for him. All right, I got you. Did he even get a send? Oh, a fiend, okay. Ah, now I wish I didn't do that last worker, but I, I 
wanted to do it because I was like, oh, I'm not getting a lioness anyways. And now this. Hmm. Well, then we might as well. Actually, I will get another one. Um, here. And then I, I think it will take some time before I upgrade this one. So I think this will be an alpha male if I if I make an alpha male. Actually, I can just build on the split. But I'm thinking about the lioness already, you know? I'll build on a split. Okay, this time I'm gonna go without my coach and I'm gonna send an ogre. Unless something is different here. Unless he said, unless he says we're not going here. Safety will die now. Not ogre? I would go Ogre, to be honest. We can still send a safety mill after income. Ah, uh, I, I think I should have stayed with my idea there. Oh, the wave was still going. I th thought we had already. Okay, never mind. Um, Then I could have sent more. So now, well, if we get a line, it's super weak. Just in case we get an aura later on. I think I should have sent an ogre. Because we had the potential to go ogre safety mall. Which I think is very good. And he has a lot of fortified. And he has a canopy, which doesn't make it much better either. And another 80. I'm not sure about the sense. Actually, we are super low value. I'm just gonna push one. He made this even lower value. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> oh well. But I, I also have a shuttle on me already, so I feel like I shouldn't play it too risky. I think it's it's probably better to play it rather safe, right? So units keep the buffs when they respawn, right? I'm, I'm not sure about Guardian Angel. Does it keep, for example, the doppelganger buffs or the lioness buffs, stuff like that? That would be good to know. I actually don't know that right now out of well, from my head. Um, I will get it though. You are next for the Not gonna be too good here, but my time will come. Sure. Because I will basically give it one deck every round now. I'm gonna build something for 12, I'm gonna build something for 13. It did not send, so yeah, I'll, I'll reroll anyways for auras or anything. Yeah, priestess. I don't think we have a good priestess spot now, unless we go only for a DPS. I think Soulgate might not be too bad though. Just to have some units spawning in the back. I don't need more Valtrims now. If I want arcane tanks, I'll get this. So with this, we'll just pick up the Soulgate. But I don't think we're going to build it before 1415, really. So I would go like this. Actually, no, I want to go with the front one. And I would say we just save it. Because they need 14 against him. Should I even add? I think I rather want to just full build 13. It seems like I'm very strong here, and I don't think they can break him that easily. Yeah, okay, good. So I shifted some gold. Very good. Now I gotta go over, though. Like, seriously. He's currently buffing a devilfish with the Dictane, alright. Ogre, then if we can get safety mole, then we can still add snails on top. Okay, let's send some snails now, because... 
Otherwise, we're not getting it. Um, 510. So, if I get a soul get, I have 250. Cannot pie. I don't think a cannot pie will really do much here. Maybe two soul gates. I can see my nest. <laughs> Catch me if you can. One for the splits. Could be good. I didn't have anything cheaper to sell. Maybe we get the snail. Maybe not. Three hundred. Oh, actually, only two forty. Just two, uh, three king upgrades. Okay, good. We can go push. Very confident we can hold 14 with the current setup. Not the best focus, but uh, the soul gates will keep spawning stuff. At least one more time. And that should then be a hold. Nice. But they're also doing good. Uh, three leaks on my lane. He's gonna hold that. Okay, we keep pushing. I didn't have Divine Blessing or something like that, right? Actually, I actually didn't pay attention to that. Overwork wouldn't make sense. Do 6300 with overwork? Yeah, I don't know about that. Okay, so we want the full tank now. Um, I'll save the rest because I don't think there's going to be a recent here. You are next. And we definitely get the iron scales. Or we go... Well, Hellgate is also good, I guess. Yeah. I think a 15 recent is unlikely. Oh, he lost his area on 13? Ah, uh, shit. Do two s he got two f How much did he get? 240. He lost his area, damn. That's unfortunate. Yeah, well, I guess he has to push to kind of break yellow. Like... I think I have Teal under control. Oh, we gotta see. Probably 16. But maybe a couple more workers would do, do wonders. You are next. Um, yeah, I'm gonna predict... I think Hellgate is better for both waves, to be honest. We'll go with this. And then here... Oh. They're bad on every wave. I can honestly get an alpha male, that's good 16, 17. But then the next would be upgrading this. This again. Uh, it's it's okay. I'm only gonna lose a little bit of value on the alpha male. It's honestly not too important. So what do we do? You wanna go now? Alright. So we now got an Azeria that's getting buffed, okay. I think my forest is getting to that. But in case he buffs it more, I need to get one forest, I think. And now we get to save the mode for income, right? Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, we gotta get the front value here. So getting the alpha male would be, would be a play here. And I, I think then I just get another Hellgate and just hope that they actually spawn stuff. I mean, at least they will spawn stuff to tank for the two Sky Queens, but yeah, of course, that's not exactly what I want. Does it make sense to send a Hermit? Not really. He doesn't have too much Tempest Leviathan value now. Okay, 540. The sense this game aren't too crazy. I feel like we, we shut them down pretty well early on. That they couldn't really get that strong. That's good. Okay, some more tanks coming in here. That will be a big leak on my side. That will be a shutdown, unfortunately. But 
it looks like they pushed for it. And we're just gonna win here. Because... Yeah. Even if it's a race, we're gonna have the defense bonus. So it should be fine. GG! I don't know if we would have died to that. We had only two king upgrades. But uh, interesting game, interesting insight there. Didn't have like hyper carries or anything, but felt felt good. I think that felt good. I felt like I thought a lot about my 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 steps in this game. Um, I would have sent slightly different mercs. Don't know how the outcome would have been on those. Um, but I felt confident, and in the league in the end on sixteen, yeah. I guess it didn't matter at that point because they must have pushed workers for that. The 13 was the send, right? So they had both at 11. 16? 16? Oh, he's. Okay, he said on 16, so. I guess I should have just done better. <laughs> but the recommended value, like, with, with these incomes we had, and of course we, we didn't. Uh, we didn't send every wave, we, we saved quite a lot throughout this game. We were a bit lucky that they were often weak on the same waves. Um, yeah. I guess I could have had some more income, but even my teammate, look at it, look at him. And he got he got sent by by Teal, so could have had an easier game. So I guess I played it very controlled and that worked out. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye bye.